an archive relating to the Princess Sophia Dulip Singh. She was the daughter of Maharaja Sir Dilip Singh, a friend and confidant of Queen Victoria and Prince Consort. She was quite an enigmatic figure and was tireless in her support of the suffragette movement at the end of the 18th century, uh, sorry, end of the 19th century, start of the 20th century. And she, this contains lots of letters uh, and correspondence relating to her work with the Indian contingent at Hampton Court. 1800 Sikh soldiers that had come back from the conflict of the First World War and had set up camp temporarily um, on the golf course near Hampton Court. And these are letters to the officers, to her, and little cuttings and postcards and letters and, and photographs. It's quite a good archive. Uh, the British society shunned her slightly because they saw it as a betrayal, because she was the daughter of Maharaja Sir Dulip Singh. And he was deposed from his empire. He was last of the Sikh uh, emperors. Um, of India uh, when he was 10. Uh, lived in exile, came to Britain in 1854 and was received with open arms by Queen Victoria and the court. He was given, he was granted, sorry, he was granted a, a pension of £25,000 a year and was given a, a country estate and was a lifelong a confidant and, and friend of the royal family. His daughter went her own way. His daughter was uh, 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 quite a mix in as much that she was, uh, her mother was half German, half Ethiopian. And um, Maharaja Sir Dilip Singh had converted to Christianity just before he came to Britain. But the nice thing was that he actually re-embraced Sikhism with his wife and his wife converted to Sikhism towards the end of, of his life. Here is uh, a document case. You can see a coronet there for Victor Dulip Singh, which was, which was Princess Sophia's brother. There's all sorts of little things in here that would have belonged to him. You've got some binoculars there, a document case. Um, this will be coming up on the 25th of May, estimate five to eight hundred pounds. I think it's a very interesting, a very complete archive.